Her snatcher picked the wrong woman to mess with. Not only did she fight him off and send him away empty-handed, she also happens to be the wife of the Santa Fe County Sheriff. Tonight, she told us how it all went down. Here's News 13's Alex Tomlin. It was a rush. You know, Antoinette Solano's voice should be a little hoarse today. I was screaming and I was tugging at the purse. I was saying that you're not going to get my purse, you know? You're just not going to get my purse. And her arm is in this sling. I uh, sprained my shoulder. But she still got her purse. It was rush hour yesterday afternoon on Meadow Street in Santa Fe. Just got off of work. Uh, needed gas. Solano was just pulling out of this gas station when she noticed a van following very close behind her. She pulled over to let the driver pass. But he pulled over too and rushed to her passenger side window. You know, I rolled my window down. I thought maybe he needed help. He didn't. And he lunged in and uh, grabbed my purse. I grabbed my purse back and uh, uh, we struggled for, you know, was maybe Min a minute. The man had a weapon. He had one of those, like a souvenir baseball little bat. He did not use it. I guess the screaming scared him a little bit, and uh, he let the purse go. This isn't your ordinary purse snatching, though. You see? He told me, you know, Antoinette, he said you, you should have just given up the purse. Antoinette's husband is Santa Fe County Sheriff Greg Solano. She's tough, though. She called him just seconds after the struggle. She said... I, they just try to steal my purse. We normally advise people just to give up the purse, wallets, whatever they ask for. While he's proud of his wife... Yeah, I would rather she just gave it up and didn't get hurt. Tonight, her attacker is still out there. I just want him to, if he sees this, to change his life and do, do good, do something good. Alex Tomlin, KRQE News 13. The purse snatcher is described as a man in his mid-20s, Hispanic. He was driving a beat-up van that had just been primered.